What's going on guys? Horror Junkies back with another video. Yes. Terrifier 3. Teaser trailer. Damien Leone's Terrifier. That's right. Terrifier 3. I am stoked for this movie. Uh, we got some things to talk about after this trailer. Um... But before we get into this trailer, I would definitely appreciate you guys if you would hit that subscribe button, that thumbs up button, and go and hit that notification bell just because you've done click the other two, so you might as well click the third one. That's right. <laughs> Whew. Terrifier 3. Man, we got some things to talk about after this. Um, the When this came out, they said that this trailer or this movie <clears throat> is going to be very controversial. So let's go and get into this. Fuck. Oh, dude. I'm so, I'm so excited because I love the terrifier. I love the franchise. And right now we're getting ready to get to third installment. I do believe it's next year, but uh, let's get into this teaser. Like right now. They did say it was going to be during Christmas, so we are getting a new horror Christmas movie. Loving it. Oh, is that Sandy Lou? No, it's not. It's not. <laughs> Although he was the Grinch. That's how it is. You just never know what you're going to get with art. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, it's great. <laughs> so there you have it, guys. Nice little teaser. There was just a little bit more though. And you guys know me. I, I, I'm not real big on big trailers, but I want a little bit more of that. Cause <clears throat> so let's get into the controversy part because I do believe, I do believe this is this, this is the part they're talking about. Um, the real question is, and we all know how killing kids in horror movies we all know how that works out. There's a there's a written rule that you can do it. You just can't show it. So, are they going to go beyond that? Are they going to show it? That's what I want to know. <laughs> and I'm sure by looking at this, that's what everybody wants to know. I guarantee it. Are they going to go beyond the not showing kids being killed in horror movies? Are they going to break that boundary? Are they going to do it? <laughs> I wouldn't put it past. I wouldn't put it past them at all. Would not. Um, and, you know, it's not like the little kid dies for real. So, you know, they had this thing with Halloween kills where the 
bunch of firefighters and their families got pissed off because they were killing firefighters. Well, they didn't really die. So it's not like it's real. I mean, they die but in real life, but not by Michael Myers. So, but this is the big question for this movie because we know that they've went far and beyond and they, their, their kill sequences in this movie. There's got to be one. There's got to be one that's talked about. So is this going to be the one? Is this, are they going to start out with it? Um, it's really hard to say, but on that note, I went to Scarefest about a month ago and it was in Lexington, Kentucky. Man, it was huge. It was really fucking huge. Uh, the biggest horror con that I've been to yet. Um, and fortunately I got to meet David Howard Thornton and the Pell girl. And I'm not even going to try to say her name because I can't pronounce it. I've tried. Not going to do it. But I got to talking, you know, and I, and I hit up David the first day we got there. And there wasn't such a, a, a huge crowd. Um, and I actually got to talk to him for like 10 minutes. He was a really cool guy. Um, interesting to hear him talk because we don't get that. Um really down to earth, really cool guy. And, uh, we talked about the, the blood, the gore. And and he looked at me and he said, just wait till the next one. He said, it's going to get a lot better. Um, he did tell me that they hired professional makeup artists for this third one. They got a way bigger budget. Um, and, He told me, he's like, if you think the last major kill was big, he said, just wait till this one. He said, the whole movie is a lot gorier. So I'm stoked, you know, just talking to him and now seeing this teaser, I just can't wait. Um, I would say this will be the third movie and then just with two. And all's ho- the All Hallows Eve that Art the Clown was in. Um, he's already he's already on his way to being an icon horror figure. Um, he after the second one he hit my top five for sure. Um, of course we all love Michael, Jason, Freddy, Leatherface. We all love them, but this guy's he's coming full forward. You know what I mean? He he is coming full force. He wants he wants that spot, and this is. You know, we haven't got a new horror icon in a long time. Um, in this movie, this franchise is not that old. Um, and for him to already be where he's at, he's got a he's got a fan base that's absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> um already. Um, I I do believe he's going to be one of the next icons in horror. Um, so you guys can let me know how you feel about that, but man, I'm just so stoked. He, he's got this, of course we're getting it in Christmas. They've already said that, um, the controversy, we'll just have to see if that's what it's going to be. You know, um, you can tell that the, the cinematography, um, is a lot better just off this little teaser that we're getting. Um, it just looks amazing. Um, I think Art's a little creepier with the long white hair. <laughs> I'm just saying. I mean, he's already creepy, but I think the Santa Claus hair made him a little bit more creepier. Um, I really do. He also looked like he gained some weight. Yeah, you know, he's got that fake Santa suit on, you know. But let me know what you guys think about this teaser, man. It looks really good to me, and I can't wait just because I'm a huge fan. I got the, I I got the hoodie. You know what I mean? Huge, huge fan. David Howard Thornton's a really cool guy. Um, got his autograph, talked to him for a little bit. Actually really cool guy down to earth. Funny. You know, he was, he was just real funny, real fun to talk to. Um, and I wouldn't, he's coming, he's actually coming here. 
uh, next year. So I'll get to meet him again. I think I'm going to have him sign an art mask uh, this time around. So let me know what you guys think about this teaser um, in the comments below. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. Let me know how much you love Art the Clown. Or if you don't, if you hate him, let me know that too. I'm down for the conversation. Um, my opinion's not everybody else's. So let's do this. Let's let's talk some Terrifier and Art the Clown and how you feel about this teaser that we're getting. And I'm sure we're going to get something within the next couple months, maybe a bigger trailer. Um, can't wait for that. But like always, guys, thank you for tuning in. Like always, really appreciate all you guys' views, your comments um, on YouTube and Facebook. Appreciate you guys. And that's going to be it for the Terrifier 3 teaser trailer. This is Horror Junkies. And I'm out.